guys, it's Thursday, July 20th. Um, I'm actually off today, but I'm just coming back from a work meeting that we just had. Um, it, it's actually more for the newer people that just had joined our crew at work. Um, and I was supposed to be there for four hours, but because I already pretty much know all the stuff that they were gonna train people on, um, they let me go early plus it's my day off so they were like you know what you, we can just cover the stuff that you need to be covered with um or or trained on um when it happens because a lot of the stuff that i need training on is actually stuff that we don't do as often so that's why i need training on it because we i just i'm like um we don't do it that much and you guys haven't really covered it with me so anyways I get to go home <laughs> two hours earlier than everybody else because I've been a vet tech uh, registered a veterinary technician for thir about 13 years already so I already kind of know my shit um, so that's why I'm, I'm going home right now uh, I'm going to help Steve with some more of our like storage stuff and moving things around um, we're hoping to get out of that house uh, in about a week so it, we still have a few more things to do but not too much it, it's not horrible and actually you know he just found um, a cabin at a KOA near us um, that we can oh my perfect timing this is the universe helping us out right now um we need a cabin at the end of july um to for us to like find an rv that we really like and then we could just buy it so um we oh my god the universe provides sometimes man like we found a cabin for august 1st for 10 days and that's perfect. That's exactly what we need right now. Um, or, or for those times. We couldn't find a cat, uh, an actual like camping spot for tents and stuff like that. Which is what we wanted because it was cheaper. But, um, you know, it, it's like peak season in our area for camping and all that good stuff. So, we just, we couldn't get it. But, we got a cabin. That's great. And it's so much cheaper than getting a hotel room. And we're both really into camping and all that stuff and outdoors and the crap so it works out really great we found a cabin for 10 days hopefully in those 10 days we find an RV that we really love um, and then we'll just buy it we'll have we'll at, at that point hopefully we'll have just enough money to buy our own RV for I don't know ten to fifteen thousand dollars I think will be uh, available for us to be able to do that um, and it won't have like the warranty that we wanted but sorry, I'm like trying to adjust the camera while I'm driving it's probably not a great idea but, but yeah I mean we're just gonna find what we can find and we'll go from there and we'll have the, the beginning of our adventure happen when we find that Oh my god, there is so much traffic right now. It's ridiculous. Look at this. All right, I'll, I'll just show you. Look at that. And this is like for a few miles. This is yeah. This is kind of crazy, but whatever. It is what it is. Babe. Yeah. So, anyways, um. Once we find an RV that we want and all that good stuff, I'll hopefully I can save up enough money to buy a laptop that can can handle video editing and you know I have so much music that I want to download on it. Um, so I need a laptop that can handle video editing, music videos pictures stuff like that to you know chronalize our adventure with our rv living and all that great stuff um so yeah 
that's where we're at, man. We're just taking it one day at a time, selling what we can sell, getting the money that we need to get for our RV and making plans. I, I feel like there's a light under or, or at the end of this tunnel right now, which is, I mean, we're like halfway through the tunnel and you can see it at the end right now and it's a really great feeling it, and it's happening pretty fast which is really great too oh my god check this out this is the rv right here right there but yeah so one day me and steve are gonna be in that spot where we're just living and traveling and living life man it's gonna be great all right well that's all i have for now um eventually these are gonna get a little more interesting um i do have a few stories that i want to tell with my really good friend natalie um i've been totally neglecting her lately and it, it, it feels horrible really um because she's my girl and we had a lot of fun times together and i i want I want to be able to relive those stories and, and have story time with you guys because we've had some pretty fun adventures together. Um, yeah, one in particular that comes in, in into mind. Um, there was this one time we went to the city, San Francisco, and we met Sasha Gray. She's like my most favorite porn star of ever. So that story will be coming hopefully sooner rather than leather, later um, when I when I can hang out with Natalie and we can tell you guys that story because it's, it's a fun one. It was a whole weekend of just shenanigans. <laughs> it was great. Alright guys, well that's all I have for now. Um, I promise these will get a lot more interesting. And thank you, thank you very much if you do sit through these really boring updates. But, I mean, this is the very, very beginning of our adventure. And hopefully at one point, you know, I'll have a legit, like, vlogs um, with, like, you know, a beginning and a slogan and whatever. So, alright. That's all I got. Peace.